All right, what's up everybody? Another day, another property tour. So today I'm here in the west side of the Las Vegas Valley in a mass plan community of Summerlin. And this is a gated community just right off the 215 and also Charleston. The mailbox is gonna be right here. So just a quick plug, um, the rehabbers here or the investors are the Bocalit Brother Groups, and this is also their listing too as well. The asking price on here is $1,399,999. This home was actually built in 1999. Square footage is 3,270 square feet, three bedrooms, total four baths. This home has been completely remodeled. As you can see, we also have a three car garage. The eaves here are two feet eaves, which is really nice. That does help with the sun as well. The landscaping on here is really good. They did a really good job. Also, uh, you'll see uh, we've got the crew here today. We are also doing some uh, Instagram for this uh, home as well. So don't mind them. So as we come into the French stores, the layout on here is like literally unbelievable. As you walk in, this beautiful, great room area here, you just like... Nice and open, orange peel texture. I mean, this home just makes you feel like you are literally like outside. You got a two-tone paint. Looks like we have eight inches on the baseboards. They did the custom railing as well. Coming through the French doors. Well, we already came through the French door. So it looks like we have a bedroom downstairs. We got nine foot ceilings. Nice carpet, original windows. Looks like they added a brand new uh, doors here. Then we have our three quarter bath. So this would actually be for the guests. So this is actually perfect. You got luxury laminate flooring, black schluters, 12 by 24 on the tile. Then you have that soap box to match the shower pan. We've got some lights here. I love how they integrated the gold with the black trims. York, you gotta make sure all the lights are turned on, man. We got formal dining. York, did you get all the lights turned on? You gotta turn on all the lights, man. No, I just literally went through this whole house. There's like a bunch. Uh, here's your phone with that. Now, if you guys want more measurements, uh, go ahead and click on the link in the description below. You have this custom fireplace, too. Uh, you have this TV that's already pre-wired and built in, ready to go. Typically, that's also included. Uh, this video is going to be pretty fast. Now, if you guys are interested, like I said, click on that link. Looks like they also redid all the can lightings, too, as well. Thermostat built in refrigerator and it looks like we've got some additional cabinet space oh i love what they did right here with the shelves then we're going to come back on this side rudy's filming me i'm filming rudy now let's take a look at this laundry room you have the front load washer and dryer samsung and then we have additional folding space for your clothes and stuff like that White shaker cabinets. Love this sink right here, this undermount. All right, let's come into the garage. Now the garage has been epoxy. Oh, so kind of runs in an angle here, which is pretty creative. I like this because this home is just not squared off. So you had a soft water here. looks like they took taken that out. You have an access to the side of the backyard. Let's see what this thing actually looks like. Okay. The reason why that's going off is because there's a pool there. Oh well. Had to reconnect that. Oh yeah, show me the 
or something, that would be funny. You could cheat it. Now we got gray like cabinets. This, then, you could just then we it. have a nice tone here. Right? Different color right. cabinets, very warm. As you can see, dovetails again. You got the herringbone with the ghost schluters. 42 upper okay. cabinets with the 8 inch, uh, 18 double stack with a 3 inch crown. They added the Sconson lights here. Get undermounted sink. Love this. Pot filler as well. And look at this 48 inch Thor. You've got a 6 burner, and then you've got the griddle here too as well. And I love this hood, how they cladded this. Here's kind of like your little sitting area. Now let's take a look at this. We have pretty huge island. This is a 5 by 12 on the island here. And this is a gorgeous island. And they skinned the back of this, which is great. Love this 2 inch front face. And I love the veins on here. This thing is just gorgeous for this slab. And I like how they just didn't do the drawers. They did the pot drawers here. They ran it linear to keep this more modern. Then you got your sharp microwave. Then what we're gonna do is, you know what, let's go to the backyard real quick. So that way, let me show you guys what's going on. You got this synthetic grass, beautiful pool. Ooh, that's... I don't like these uh, palm trees or these pines. I would definitely cut the pines. Original air conditioning units. Look at that brand new pump it looks like. Love the fact that you have a side axis here. You can throw, you, throw away your trash from the garage and roll out your trash can. Looks like the exterior has been painted. They added some pavers. This is a gorgeous pool though. Now remember, here's the value in here. You, you can no longer build a large pool like this. Remember, pools are gonna be a hot commodity because according to the county, now it is 600 square feet for a pool. 600, that would be 20 by 30. And this is probably bigger than 20 by 30 here. You have another side axis here. It is deeper on this end and there's actually a little bench seat here, which is really nice. Love the jacuzzi. All right, let's go inside. Oh, lot size real quick is uh, 8,276 square feet. We're gonna make our way upstairs. Wow, closet. All right, let's go upstairs, all brand new carpet. There's no blinds on here, which if you guys need blinds, let me know. I know somebody that knows somebody. <sighs> Take a look at this view right here. Gorgeous. We got additional storage space. Wow, this is pretty large for a storage space. You could literally knock all this out. Throw a pony wall here or a railing. Open all this. This could be a pretty... Decent size little. Man, look at that. That thing is just gorgeous. You really definitely feel like you are outside. Look at this, we have a thermostat here. Always right above the thermostat, you should always have your return line. All right, let's head down this hallway into the uh, primary. Now this primary is 18 by 16. Again, if you guys want more information about this, click on the link in the description below. Here we have the feature wall with the constant lighting. So you can see the French doors, the modern propeller. What I like about the Bogler Brothers group, you get the TVs, washer, the dryer, minus the furniture. Now as we come into the bathroom here, as you can see we have the 24 by 48 inch. We have nice hand pulls here, but the gold hand pulls don't match the faucets and the reason why is different manufacturers and they specialize in certain things so the manufacturer for this doesn't build or manufacture faucets so you're never going to get the same color but it's pretty close you can't even tell 
like these mirrors here and this bathroom they did a really good job they ripped out the bathroom did the uh, freestanding tub now as we come in on the pan here we have herringbone and look at this water tower here look at that another cool thing is that give that custom look around the window they did the schluters all the way around love the fact that they put a towel here a little towel hook then we have our spa a little bench area definitely would add some led lights and then the soapbox is kind of cool like how they just ended it right here and again these guys are known to add additional shower uh, look at this i don't even know what is this called but this is like super modern but cool at the same time you got the rainfall shower head here you have a nice thick glass let's take a look at this thing again undermounted sink you got the toilet wow oh man i love how they skin this here nice and just open all right let's head on down this way so we got bedroom here very unique shape of a bedroom you got a ceiling fan this one's up more in the front so your sun exposure is going to be on this side of the house and this one has its own bathroom which is really nice look at that and we have our shower it's very small but it feels with the color of the tile it makes it look more open so i do like that and we have our toilet here Let's see if this other bedroom has a bathroom Oh yeah, it does. Now let's go take a look at this. Nice large sink original cast iron tub. I think I would have probably left this the same color as the other bathroom with the white subway tiles and ran it linear. But it's not my house. I didn't design it. But I can just tell you what I like. All right, guys, that is pretty much it. Are we ready to go, York? I don't know where I left my piece of paper at. Oh, here it is. All right, guys, so let me know what your thoughts are about this property. Um, the HOAs here are, believe it or not, $80 a month. The master is $55. If you guys want more information, go ahead and click on the link in the description below. Also, give a quick shout out to the Bulk of the Brothers group. They did a really good job. If you guys don't have a real estate agent, uh, give me a call because I definitely would love the opportunity to earn your business. The cost is free $99. That's right, free $99. All right, guys. Thank you so much for tuning in. I'm Chuck. It's Cruz One with Simply Vegas. And have a blessed day. If you guys want to check out all our video home tours, we have over 1,800 video home tours. Just go ahead and click on this video right here. If you guys are in the market and you want to purchase a home and want to get started, visit lvhomeexperts.com. Scan this QR code right now. Also, if you guys just love real estate and want to get into real estate, go ahead and subscribe to our second channel. Until next time, peace.